Hey guys, it's me, my reborns, and I am back with another video. Today is Thursday, June 1st, and it's currently 6.44 p.m. And I'm trying to talk loud because I have the fan on. Because my sister's in the background, she's talking really loud. So I left the fan on. Also, it's hot. Apparently, it's 91 degrees. I don't believe it. I believe it when I step outside and I've been outside today so I don't believe it but anyways the fan is on and it's not 91 it's 77 I just checked why would sh okay forget it anyways <laughs> I have the fan on um the central air is on but it's like it comes on automatically then turns off automatically comes on automatically it does that anyways it's hot so I just decided to leave it on because she's talking loud it's hot but I'm gonna try to speak over it. Anyways, I just lost my topic. No, I had a topic, what was it? I didn't wanna come on this video without having the topic because my last couple of videos haven't been having topics. And so I was scrolling through my list of topics and one just randomly came to me that was really good, but I forgot what it was. I mean, was it really good if I just forgot it that fast? Mm. I remembered it <laughs> I remember my topic guys okay so let me say the topic before I forget it again oh my gosh that's crazy so my topic is how long is too long um and I'm gonna just be talking about shipping because that's like the number one question I get like if it's not where do you get these dolls from from like people who don't know or are new to the hobby they ask me where do you get the dolls they asked me where do you get the dials from but they also asked me like how long does it take so i just wanted to talk about that for today's video and the topic and actually this fan i know is going to be a mess i'm just going to turn it off actually so just give me a second guys okay i turned it off i just don't want to feel like i'm sh i'm screaming so i just ended up turning it off if you guys hear background noise and talking try to ignore it <laughs> But okay, so that's the topic, and um, I have Milano here with me. We're gonna change him out of this little sleeveless romper into this sleeveless onesie. And Memorial Day was actually Monday, so this would have been perfect for. I'm tongue tied. This would have been perfect for Memorial Day, but I was lazy. That's why you guys haven't been seeing any videos from me. I'm just lazy. I'm not afraid to say it. <laughs> um, no, but I haven't really been, not really super busy, and I've been trying to stay inside. But I just, I don't feel like it. So anyways, that's our topic. That's the onesie. And we're going to go ahead and change him, which is not going to take long at all. So I hope this video is not going to be too long. But I don't want it super short either. But anyways, okay. So also, I keep talking. But if you guys get a glimpse of my pants, these are clean. But I hope my friend paint her last room white. And so... I wore these and this was like back in January and long story short the paint never came out and I should have knew that the paint I should have knew not to wear these because they're like one of my favorite pants to lounge in and I should have knew that the paint wouldn't have came out because I used to mix paint and a, one time it had got on my vest and I got on my work vest and it never came out like it stayed there the whole time and guess the color the color was she wanted like an army green it was like a dark green and it looked like poop so <laughs> it looked like baby poop let me say that because yeah anyways i should have known i shouldn't have wore these because the paint really does not come off the clothes at all even if you wash and same day because i literally washed my vest i think that same night when i got home because i got off work at like 10 and it was on there anyways let's go ahead and change milano and uh, talk about how long does it take to receive a baby all right so let's talk about when the baby is already made so if the baby is already made you pay the baby off either in full or you just got done making your last payment when should you be expecting your baby to arrive and this is different for for everyone because it's not a manufacturer that you're buying this from these are like real people you know they have things going on they have like a life and some things can happen um but i say three days um is the max 
time to ship out of course like i said things do happen and if they need longer than that they will let you know but i just say three days because that's the time frame that i ship things out i usually try to do next day but if i'm working late or um i'm not able to make it or something just happens like with the post office being closed because that actually happened to me back in november i went and the post office was literally closed so i wasn't able to ship out that day i had to ship out the next day or like a holiday so you can't ship then either a lot of factors does come in when shipping but i do say three days max um again it is different for everyone for me it's three days again i do try to do next day but sometimes two days i don't think i ever went three days without shipping a baby but uh, i have went two days because the post office was closed and then one time it was a holiday and it always seems like that because one time I tried to ship a baby out in September, but it was Labor Day and it was closed. And then just last November, I tried to ship out a baby, but the post office was closed. And I don't know if it was Thanksgiving or what, but it was closed, so I couldn't ship the baby out. And I was mad because I drove there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, plus the post office kind of closed early. They closed at like 5 or 6, and most people don't get off until that time. Uh, anyways, yeah. So... I ship using USPS, which is the United States Postal Service. Um, I know a lot of people have stopped using them, and that's understandable. However, I still use them just because I know it is one to three day priority mail. So that's why I still use them versus having to pay $100 for UPS and you get your baby in that time frame, or if you decide to not pay that money then you get your baby in like a week <laughs> so yeah each each one has their flaws okay no mailing system in my eye is perfect but uh, yeah so if your baby was sent out using usps and they use priority mail you're expected to get your baby in one to three days of course things can happen holidays come into play and your baby can get delayed um, sometimes it's not even the holidays your baby just got delayed and it could just be an extra day or two and so I really say the time frame is five days and that's including them shipping the baby out and that's also including you getting the baby and the baby being delivered I really be getting these babies early almost all of my babies got here a day early and they were shipped out the next day or two days after I paid for them so I say they're really fast. Now with customs, that is a different story. Um, because it's a custom. So if you get a custom, it usually takes a couple of months to even get painted and finished being painted. So it does take a while longer for customs. But I really do say that same time frame. So usually as soon as the artist finished the custom, they ship the baby out same next day, two, three days later, and then they arrive to you in a couple of days. But yeah, um, however, I do want to say a week at most because I know the babies can be stuck forever and they don't take the one to three days. And sometimes it does end up being a week. Um, I think with UPS, it's like three to five days, five to seven one of those um unless you do you know the priority for ups and you can get your baby in like one three days but usually when i get my babies through ups it is like five days and then when i get my babies through usps it's like two to three days so yeah um i hope that answered everything because i do get asked that quite a lot and i always thought it was interesting to get asked that question um it's probably like yeah like i said it's one of like the most asked questions behind like where do you get the baby from i get that question a lot asking how long it takes for the baby so yeah um i wanted to do his hair for you guys i should have been doing that while i was talking but i don't have anything else to add on to this if you guys want to share your experience below you can i've never had anything bad happen to any of my babies and i don't even want to say this in the air 
Um, I don't even have any wood by me to knock on it, but knock on wood, I haven't had any packages get lost or anything like that. The most I had was a package got delayed by a day or two, and I think two days is really, really pushing it. I really think I only had a baby get delayed by one day, so yeah. I'm going to fix his hair off camera because I'm actually going to change the style. I have two little bands over here, so I'll probably give him like some ponytails. I think that'll be cute for him. Um, I'll probably change Saint. I'll probably go ahead and change Saint next because you guys know I got three onesies. Um, they're similar. They're not the same, but they are very similar. And I changed seven into one, and he is still for sale, by the way. As well as I have a blank Zoe by Natalie Blake kit, and I have a reborn Margot by Cassie Grace. And I have Scarlet and Wilborn Claudia for sale as well. Just had to throw that out there. But um, yeah, I changed seven into his like. A long time ago, it feels like. <laughs> and I was supposed to have changed Saint and Milano into theirs, but I just never did. So I finally got around to changing him. And so I'll probably go ahead and do Saint next and change him into his little matching onesie. But yeah, okay. That is pretty much it for this video, guys. Um, This is Milano again. Uh, I don't really have anything else to say, but I just want to... Every time, <laughs> I do this every time I bring Milano on. Every time I bring him on, I don't have anything else to say, but I just want to keep talking so you guys can see him because he's so cute. I look at him. But yeah, he's excited for the summertime and the weather. I need to get some sleeveless newborn onesies so that they can go under these little sleeveless onesies because... Um, I mean, the cloth doesn't show too bad since he fits this pretty good, but I don't really like when the cloth shows. Oh, I forgot he has a belly plate. A couple of my babies actually have belly plates, but I don't use them. Okay. Um, let me go ahead and take you guys down and close out this video because it's an unnecessary extra long five minutes that did not need to be added so let me take you guys down and then close it out all right so this is milano in his onesie again this would have been perfect for memorial day but yeah this is the first day of june and so we're hoping you guys is june is filled with nothing but positivity and love so happy June, yay. This is my first video being recorded in June and my first video being posted in June. <laughs> but yeah, I always find that so exciting when I record like a video on the start of the month and then it's the first video that I get put out in the month since I pre-record my videos. Anyways, I'm rambling. If you guys want to go ahead and follow me on Instagram, you guys can do so at Maya underscore reborns. And if you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up, comment up below, and if you guys want the comments including very first if you're subscribe to my channel, hit that subscribe button, also ring that bell so you guys can always be notified when I post another video. And we will talk to you guys later. Bye. Yeah.